New information tonight on a story we've been working on for you all day. Roanoke police arrest a man they say threw a brick at Senator Mark Warner's Roanoke office. Police say 36 year old James Trainer damaged the front door. He's facing a charge for property damage. This is what the door looked like this morning. The brick was stuck in the broken glass, as you can see. This is downtown on Kirk Avenue near 2nd Street. Police say it happened around 730 this morning. Warner's press secretary says no one was in the office at the time, and the senator is grateful for the quick response from Roanoke Police. It's unclear whether it was politically motivated. Police tell 10 News that the charge cannot be more severe just because the property belongs to a politician. The charge against him is the same as it would be if the damage was to a restaurant or other business. Republican U.S. Representatives Morgan Griffith and Bob Goodlap both condemn the, vi the vandalism and hope police catch the person who did it. Griffith says, quote, peaceful disagreement is a cornerstone of free societies. And Goodlap says, quote, I want to make it clear that there are appropriate ways to express your opinion, and this is not one of them. Police say anyone who has any information should contact them.